Hello everyone, my name is Sean Brown. I'm the Vice President of Sales at Longevity, and today I wanna to cover with you a quick summary of our compensation plan so that you can learn it in less than 10 minutes. Now, you'll be able to watch this video that's being recorded over and over again until you really understand it, and I'm gonna go through a lot of the terminology, definitions, and strategies associated with our compensation plan. So most people ask me about what is a unit level, right? There's lots of different compensation plans out there. The longevity compensation plan is known as a unit level. There are two strategies that come into play when building in a unit level. One, you want to build wide. You want to have as many legs as possible because the more legs you have that are healthy and strong and thriving, the higher your volume is to you as you build out deep um, over time, bringing you more income and a higher percentage of your sales will get paid to you in commissions. So two strategies, one, build wide, as many legs as you can and deep. And, and we call that tap rooting. And you'll continue to tap root working with your people to bring in people until you build a nice, healthy, wide and deep organization. That's a unit level. Well, first let's go through some terminology so that you understand our compensation plan and how it works. The first thing I need you to understand is that every item that is bought or sold with Longevity has four things associated with it. The first is a retail price. The second is a wholesale price. The third is what we call QB, which is qualifying points. And the fourth is BB, or business volume, commissionable points. Okay? So, retail, most of you won't sell at retail, but there's a 20% difference in the price between retail and wholesale. Most of you will sell at wholesale. All preferred customers and distributors purchase products from Longevity at the wholesale price, which is 20% off of retail. The QB associated with the product is usually equal to or right around the wholesale price. Those qualifying points are not your commissionable points, you're not paid off of them, but they are used to qualify your account, to qualify you for rank and for other purposes like contests and promotions at Longevity, The BB is what you're paid off of, usually somewhere between 70 and 80% of the wholesale price. And the BB you'll wanna pay attention to because all percentages in the comp plan are calculated off of the BB, all right? So we have QB, which is your qualifying volume, PQB. PQB is your personal qualifying volume. This is the, uh, what you use to qualify your account. Each rank has personal qualified volume associated with it. Sometimes it's 100, sometimes 150, sometimes it's 250 or more. It all depends on the rank that you're looking to hit. Personal qualified volume you get through your personal purchases, your own personal auto ship, or any products that you purchase from Longevity. GQB is your personal qualified volume plus all QB and your first three levels, okay? We'll talk more about that in a second. We talked about BB, this is what you're paid off of, business volume. PC is a preferred customer. And then we'll talk about some of these other things as we go through. Now, as you're building a longevity business, you're going to want to make sure you pay attention to both the enroller and the sponsor. Almost all people, all bonuses at Longevity, I'm sorry, are paid off of the enroller. Now, let me go over here and show you just something real quick. This is Mary, this is Adam, and this is Ryan, okay? Mary signs up, enrolls Adam and Ryan. So Mary is the enroller for both Adam and Ryan, and in this case, she's also the sponsor. The sponsor means that whoever is underneath Mary, she's the sponsor for in the actual tree. Enroller means that she enrolled them or signed them up. Now at Longevity, once you enroll someone, we give you 60 days to move them to wherever you want to help build out your structure and hit rank. Once they're moved, you can't move them again. But even after you move them, you're always the enroller on both accounts. Let me show you. So Mary in this instance has decided to move Ryan underneath Adam. Mary remains the enroller on both Adam and Ryan. And now Ryan is, the, is sponsored by Adam and no longer Mary. 
So for purposes of building out a leg in the tree, Adam can count Ryan underneath him. But for purposes of bonuses, like car bonuses and quick starts that I'm gonna cover in a minute, Mary will collect those bonuses on both Adam and Ryan because she enrolled them. So in all cases, when you're out there recruiting, you're out there sponsoring, you're out there bringing people into longevity, you should always enroll them on your personal site and then if you decide to move them later, that's fine, but you'll remain the enroller, thus getting the bonuses that you deserve for bringing them into longevity. Also, you'll be able to help out your downline where it's appropriate. I always caution, make sure you're not just giving something for nothing, unless it benefits you and benefits your business. Because when you do that, then people get entitled, they stop working, so be cautious with that. All right, so that's the difference between enroller and sponsor. So both are important, but make sure you know the difference. All right, this is what we call a sales associate at Longevity. This is really the building block of Longevity. You wanna build as many of these as possible, okay? A sales associate is one of the earliest ranks of the comp plan, and you, to become a sales associate in Longevity, need 150 QB on your own personal account and you need to bring in three people that each have 50. Now, this sales associate must be a distributor, okay? These people can be a distributor or a preferred customer. It doesn't matter which. So these little 50s can be distributors or preferred customers when you're building out the tree. Now, let me teach you something else that's super cool before we go into the nuts and bolts of the comp plan. We have what we call compression. Now compression is this. Let's say Mary's account had 100 QB on it. Adam in the month of January had zero QB on it. And Ryan had 100 QB on his account. Compression means that volume will move up each month to pay you the most that it can possibly pay you, but people don't. So the structure of the tree will stay in place but compression will actually move volume up each month to pay you the max amount of commission that you can make. And it automatically happens. You don't have to do anything. So in this instance, the 100 QB will move up to Mary's line one because Adam wasn't active in January, but Ryan will stay on level two himself. It's just that the volume will move up to pay her the most. Pretty cool, huh? We call that dynamic compression. All right, so that's that. Auto ship. Let me tell you something cool about auto ship at Longevity. Auto ship at Longevity, if you're in US or Canada, if you have over $100 on your auto ship, you're gonna get free shipping each and every month. How cool is that? So no matter what you're buying, if you have over 100 QB in your auto ship, that's not included on kits, right? Just products that are in your auto ship, you're gonna get free shipping. And in most countries around the world, they have discounted or free shipping also. You'll just wanna check with your local office depending on what country you're in. So that's AutoShip. I highly recommend getting on AutoShip and setting your AutoShip to run the first or second of the month. The reason for that is, is that way your account is qualified right at the beginning. And when it comes to quick start and fast start and other bonuses that I'm gonna to describe to you in a minute, you'll make sure that you're getting paid those in a timely fashion. Because some of these bonuses pay out weekly and you wanna make sure you're qualified each and every week of the month. That way if someone signs up, you get your bonus right away. Okay, so let's talk about what it takes to hit one star and then we'll come back to some of the bonuses. One star is the first leadership rank in longevity and it's super critical because everybody should have a goal of hitting and maintaining at least one star. The comp plan goes up two star, three star, four star, five star, but one star is what I'm gonna focus on in this video. How do you hit one star? Well, you need this. You need 250 QB on your own personal account. You need 150 on each one of the legs. You need three legs. These are sales associates, right? That I described here. And each one of these must be a distributor. So these four people all have to be distributors. After that, you need three people each underneath each one of those sales associates that has 50, and those can be customers or distributors, either way. Once that's all in place, you now need a total of 5,400 points or QV points 
in your first three levels plus your own personal level. So you are line zero, one, two, and three all have to roll the 5400. This is the cool thing. This actually will count with compression, meaning that if any of these people on these first three levels are not active, volume from your lower levels will move up and will count in your GQV. So compression will help you a lot. And that's an exciting thing because it's gonna help you hit the one star. Now, one star is your first leadership bonus. You're gonna get all kinds of things at one star and it pays you, as you can see, very deep. On level one, you make 8% of your BB, line two, 8%, line three, seven, six, six, eight, two, two, and two. Now we have this thing at Longevity called, I'm sorry, called the infinity bonus. The infinity bonus is a bonus that pays fairly deep. In fact, it will pay 2% of your BV all the way down. In most cases, it breaks after five sales associates on each finger in your tree. In other words, it can get really confusing, but it usually will break somewhere between lines 20, 25, 30. I mean, it's paying very deep. You're gonna get paid on almost everybody in your tree, which is so fantastic. You're gonna make a big check off of this once you continue to build out your uh, team wide and deep. So make sure you're doing that and paying attention to that bonus. Let me talk to you about the car bonus. The car bonus has to be unlocked. In other words, you've got to qualify for your car bonus for two months, and then you get paid for the car bonus on the third month and forward. Once you unlock it, you don't have to unlock it ever again. So for example, if I hit it in January, I hit it in February and I missed it in March, I could hit it in April, get paid, miss it in May, hit it in June, get paid. It doesn't have to be unlocked more than once, but you've got to unlock it. Now at one star, your car bonus is $300 and you get paid that on the third time you hit it. But with the car bonus at one star, you have to have 12 people with a minimum of six distributors. The other six could be preferred customers that have 100 QV. You don't have to be sponsored by you, but they have to be enrolled by you. Meaning that, you know, in this case, if this one had 100 QV and this one had 100 QV, Mary would get credit for two because she's the enroller on both. So it's the 12 that you've enrolled, doesn't matter where they're at in the tree, that have 100 QV on them each. Once you've done that and hit one star, you've unlocked the car bonus. Now, once you get the two star, you no longer need the 12. You just have to get the two star. So to unlock it, one month at one star, one month with 12 people with 100 QV each, do it again the second month, and then do it the third month and you get paid going forward as long as you hit it, $300. At two star, the car bonus jumps to $600. So you definitely wanna stay focused on it. It's a really nice bonus, okay? All right, so let's talk about quick start bonus. This is the enroller bonus at Longevity, and you get paid 30% of the BB on an order for the first 30 days of a new customer or distributor, as long as you have 100 QV on your account. It pays out weekly on a two week delay to allow for refunds and other things, but it pays out weekly. It's a fantastic bonus and it's a big part of your paycheck and it's an incentive designed to pay you out, um, you know, to get your team enrolling new people. So here's the rules about Quick Start. Quick Start actually, just write Quick Start here. Quick Start's rules are it, it pays out for the first 30 days from the enrollment date so the date they sign up, and it pays out for a maximum of 750 BV during those first 30 days, doesn't matter how many orders they place, for a maximum bonus of $225 on that. You have to be the enroller. So in this instance, going back to Mary, Adam, and Ryan, Mary's gonna get the quick start bonus on Adam and Ryan. Adam's not getting the quick start bonus on Ryan because he's not the enroller. So this is an enroller bonus and you've got to earn it every month and you need 100 QV on your account to qualify to earn quick start. That's how it works. It's fantastic and it pays out over and over again for each new person for the first 30 days. So make sure that you're ready to earn that quick start bonus. It's gonna be awesome and it's gonna be fantastic for especially for new people coming in. Okay. 
Fast Start and Coding. These are bonuses that also paid out to the enroller. I'm not gonna go through the coding bonus right now, but every time we call it a CEO Mega Pack, it's right here, is purchased or sold to anyone, there's about $290 in bonuses that get paid out to the upline. So coding's one of them, pays out to up to $190, and based on the rank that you are when you sign someone up, and based on the rank that your upline is when you sign someone up, there's a lot of people that are gonna get some cool bonuses for every CEO mega pack sold. They roughly cost about 499 US, they make someone a distributor and they give them over $500 in product to get started on their business. It's a fantastic deal and it's really the way to go at Longevity. So once you uh, buy a CEO pack, you are what we call CEO qualified and you unlock all the bonuses in the comp plan. There's two ways to get CEO qualified. One is to buy a CEO mega pack. Second is to accumulate $500 in purchases over any amount of time and once you do, you're gonna become CEO qualified. So for example, I joined in January, I can't afford a CEO mega pack, so I just set up my auto ship and I let it run. And my auto ship has 150 QV or $150 in my auto ship and it runs every month. So first month, January, second month, February, third month, March, I'm up to 450. April, I'm gonna break the $500 barrier for purchases and in May, I'm gonna become CEO qualified. Okay, so that's how that works. Skip all that and just buy the CEO pack if you can and you'll start earning bonuses right away. Now, CEO qualified is important for the car bonus. You gotta be CEO qualified. But again, you have three months to unlock it, so you've got time, okay? So that's CEO qualified, that's the car bonus and roller and sponsor we talked about. So we talked about coding a little bit. The big thing here that you need to remember is bring in new people get them on auto ship, get them to place an initial order, make sure they're plugged into the products and you're gonna be successful at Longevity. This is the comp plan in a nutshell. And I, if you ever, ever have any questions, please feel free to reach out to me. My email is sean, S-E-A-N, at longevity.com with any questions and I'll answer them for you as quickly as I can. Appreciate you guys. Happy building.